Hello everyone, and welcome back to my playthrough of Silent Hill 2 the Remake. Last time we knew that we had to go to the lake, uh, the park by the lake, uh, which was Marie, uh, Mary's and James's special place. And in order to do that, we had to cut through the Woodside Apartments, which is basically where we are now. Um, we came across a little girl when we were trying to reach for a key who kicked it away and stomped on her hand and was like, ha ha. And she ran away. Haven't seen her since. Uh, we also saw some kind of creature through, uh, like, uh, what was it? Like a gated uh, frame, I guess, uh, in in uh, one of the hallways. Uh, eventually, when we came back out, it was gone. So that's been the highlight so far. Um, we're trying to find three medallions. Uh, to order, to order, to open this thing, this cabinet in that room over there. We've seen one. We haven't been able to get it, though. And right now I'm a little confused on where exactly I need to go. So I'm just kind of making my rounds through the different uh, apartments again. Oh. Please deliver these to Miss Mrs. Millie from 102. I'm really worried about her. She's been cooped up all alone with his belongings for days on end. She won't even move them. God forbid anyone else touch anything. It's breaking my heart just thinking about it. Okay, what are we what are we taking? Do we have a key to Miss Millie's stuff? Her chance? Mayhaps. Ew. Okay, nothing here. Or nothing else here, at least. Oh, boy. And you're back up. So it's still moving. Or not. I don't like how these things can just get back up. Like if it's dead, it should stay dead. So we did also find that thing on the second floor. It was like a peep show into, uh, into a room. Like, into the next room. But I don't know how to get into that other room. That's the biggest problem right now. So over here... this oh we can push it I didn't notice that oh fuck right where the rooftops pierce through the night left our homebound footprints with no owner in sight but he has but has he found home oh please pray tell or river of memories leading right to his hell Someone watching me now? All right, we need to figure out the combination. Okay.
So there's got to be a clue to it. Right where the rooftops pierce through the night. Left our homebound footprints with no owner in sight. But as he found home, we'll please, please pray tell over a river of memories leading right to his hell. Oh, I see. What did it say about the home? I didn't want to do that. Okay. So it's something, something, 13, something. Uh, sorry, I'm just going to write these down. One, 13. It's the home. So I just need to find other images with numbers on them. Oh, there's another one. Seven. Okay, so seven foot prints house. Oh, uh, so I'll be homes. Okay. Ah, come on, I was doing well. I was starting to find the clues. Oh, here we go. Waves, 11. So, 11. Waves. Need one more. Okay, maybe there's only three. Okay, so... What is it? Right where the footsteps pierced through the night, left our home on footprints with no owner in sight. But has he found home, oh please pray tell, or river of memories leading right to his hell? Pierced through the night, the footsteps. So the footsteps are secondary. And then it's... Uh, 13 and then it's 11 so I need footsteps pierced through the night so I need footsteps of some kind all right I sincerely cannot find footsteps Okay, so I've looked everywhere. There's no fourth number. It's only three. So right where the rooftops pierced through the night, left our homebound footprints with no owner in sight. But as he found home, oh, please, please pray tell, or a river of memories leading right to his hell. So right where the footprints pierced through the night. So like that has to be the one with the homes so that'll be 13 that, that's that one right there left our homebound footprints with no owner in sight so that's seven right there but as he but has he found home or please pray tell or a river of memories leading right to his hell so that's 11 so is it 13 7 11 So 13, 7, fucking A. Get me the fuck out of this room.
Oh god. Where? I hear you. I hear you. There you are. Don't run. Oh my god, that took a long time. That took took about 15 minutes. Okay, so we got another key. To Luca Okay. Two have small staircase key. Oh, okay. I don't know where I am. to head right this way. times they kill you, you're just going to get back up. Was this door always open? Yeah, I guess it was. This looks lovely. Very inviting, doesn't it? Um, let's go down first. We got some more bullets. Have we been here? We have not. Let's unlock this. Okay. Let's explore down here. Oh. Jesus. Hey, who's there? It wasn't me. I didn't do it. I didn't do it, I swear. Hey, are you okay? 
I didn't do anything. He was like that when I got here. He? Oh, you mean the man back there? In the kitchen? I didn't do it. I swear I didn't kill him. Yeah, it's all right. I'm, I'm not saying that you did. Look, my name is James. James Sunderland. Oh, Eddie. Eddie, okay. So, uh, do you live here, Eddie? No. I'm not even from this town. It's just... Something brought you here. Yeah. Yeah, you could say that. I... Well, they came at me. I didn't know what to do, so I ran. I came here. Figured it might be safe, but, but then I found the guy in the fridge. Easy, deal. deep breaths. <sighs> Look, this place, it, it's not safe. These things, this whole town, there's something wrong with it. it. Might be best if you just get out of here. Yeah. Yeah, you're right. Hey, you want to come with? Maybe together we can find a way out of this town. Oh, sorry, but I can't leave. Not yet. I... I need to find someone. Oh. And, uh, Eddie. Be careful. Yeah, you too. Ugh. Sounded chunky. I'm sorry. What? Oh, they're outside. Eddie, are you gonna be okay? Yeah, I guess. <laughs> So now we can. It's our only interaction. All right. at least These guys are just going for a little dip. I am just totally missing, aren't I? kill them oh yeah I did okay so we got two out of the three coins we got one left we know exactly where it is we just don't know how to get it so gonna see if there's any items around Outside apartments, the gate is open from 8 a.m. to 7 p.m. Outside those hours, request assistance at the reception.
This is where we came from. I guess up there is where we go. Can we go through here? No. And we're back here. Huh. So what's still locked? Oops. What does this say? Oh, coin cabinet. Um. Tool one. So if we go up the stairs from here, then we can go to two oh one. I don't know why it's circled, I don't remember what's up there. been here yet third floor Jesus. These things barely emit any radios, uh, uh, static. Which is why they're pretty, uh, effective at, like, being scary. I know there's something here. I know. I can feel it. It all looks normal, but it's not. It's underneath, pulsing, trying to get out. Is it trying to get out? Or should I get in? 
I have to uncover it, rip it to the surface. Peel it off, layer by layer, so I can see it. I know it's there. That is a strange note. Behind the door? No, it's not. Doesn't look like it is. There you are. Where are you going? Cheeky. I was wrong, wrong, wrong. No, I wasn't, but I wasn't entirely right. I need to peel off more. Something more blood close. Ugh. I was looking outside, but it is in me. There's someone inside me. That is pretty sinister. apple. I'm gonna regret this, aren't I? Oh. There be the medallion. The doubloon. Was that the door or was that one of the machines? That was the machine. Uh, that's where we went, right? Think so? Yeah. Do we explore up here? Looks like we did, except for down this way. Right? Yeah.
All right. Very nice. Very nice. So another save. to go this way. There it is. Okay. Now for that coin cabinet. All right, fellas, let's do this. So, three bright coins, three actors in play. Yeah, within the shade, not one doth remain. The one once so gallant has fled from day's sheen as far as he could from the icon of sin. The one whom he swore to shield in her life now lays in a grave away from his sight. So, oh, whoops. So the coin that has to go here, and I guess the woman goes here away from his sight. Guess there, and then the snake. Go there, maybe. Now lays in a grave, so that needs to go there. Um, yet within the shade, not one doth remain. So, no, so that goes there because there's no one in the uh. In the shade. Or is the top one the shade? Like the middle, I mean. As far as he could from the icon of sin. Ah, okay. So that goes there. Uh, that goes there. And then maybe that there. And then that there. Has fled from day's sheen. So maybe the grave is closer. So it's got to be these three. Three bright coins, three actors in play, yet within the shade, not one doth remain. Oh, is it no one's under the tree? Maybe. As far as he could from the icon of sin. Oh, so that has to be there. Hmm. 
This has to be as close as it is. The graveyard has to be behind the guy. Has fled from day's sheen. Sorry, guys, I'm just trying to... The one so gallant has fled from day's sheen as far as he could from the icon of sin. So this has to be the icon of sin. The one whom he swore to shield in her life now lays in a grave away from his sight. See, here's what I'm thinking. I think... Why did that work? His blade strikes... I could swear he did this one. Okay, well, that worked. His blade strikes that from the roots doth rise, followed by guilt and the mark of demise. His blade strikes that from which the root doth, doth rise followed by guilt and the mark of demise. The life he once had, he has left behind, where once there was love, now a stone resides. Okay. So his blade strikes that from which the Ruth does rise, followed by guilt and the mark of demise. The life he once had, he has left behind, where once there was love, now a stone resides. So the stone is obviously the gravestone. It's just a matter of placing them in... It doesn't really say what order to put them in. The life he once had, he has left behind. Where once there was love, now a stone resides. I'm guessing he has left behind. Is it saying like actually left? Or once there was love, now a stone resides.
I'm just trying everything at this point. Guess I'm not as smart as I thought I was. Okay, the blade from which the roots roots doth strike rise. I mean, blade, it's obvious. This is the blade. How did that work? The blade was supposed to be in the middle. It says where the roots doth rise. He kneels by the crown that casts a cruel shade onto the visage of her who did fade. By not by them not a soul, not a sight nor sound, and yet evil slithers upon radiant ground. Okay, radiant ground has to be where the sun is. He kneels by the crown that casts a cruel shade. onto the visage of her who did fade. So maybe that's here in the middle? By them not a soul, not a sight, nor sound. So maybe here? Maybe these guys are switched. Oops. Okay, that made sense. The beast that from death and decay had spawned. He who has failed, she who's now beyond. Now you pass the judgment on figures of play and choose where the burden of sin doth lay. The beast that from death and decay had spawned. Okay, that second one was ridiculous. That one, that one, the clues were terrible on that one. Oh, fuck, I'm gonna save. Yeah, sure. That took forever. Okay, so 201 was, no, was this way, if I remember correctly. something fucking pops out at me. Of all the mannequins are looking right at the door. The fuck was that? Sounded like a woman gasping.
Oh shit. It hurt. Why would you open the door before it even leaves? Yeah. Well, that was interesting. Why would you shoot it in, like, the metal plates? Nice physics. Yeah, let, let's follow it. the other world for the first time. Looks like we're in the other world. Yeah. I mean, not that you really notice. Everything kind of looks like a mirror image. Oh yeah, this place looks dark and dilapidated. Like, that is... Yeah. Sorry, I'm kind of nerding out at the moment. I don't have a map. I'm pressing up, but like nothing's happening. Maybe this is, yeah, this is the map. Okay. I was gonna say, if you're gonna reach me from there, That'd be fucking nuts. I dodged too... too late. Okay. I had a feeling... So, 
these guys are a little bit more aggressive <coughs> in the other world. Like in this world, I mean. Um, they move a little bit faster. Um, and it looks like they're a little bit quicker. Ooh, excuse me. Where? Oh. Interesting. do I have? I got a lot, actually. I was actually going to say, maybe we should use the bullets for the other world monsters. As, uh, as I mentioned, it looks like they're a little bit more aggressive. Well, a little, a lot more aggressive. And they actually burst when they die. So that's a. So it doesn't seem to be a, um, like a heavy hit. Like if you hold the button down, it doesn't like charge up. Sorry, just scratch up my arm. Okay, so this is the moth room, I'm guessing. I can't go in there. What did you write? M on door. Say, I almost missed that door, but it looks like it doesn't do anything anyway. Oh, come on. First comes their leader, most crucial his quest. His pace slow but steady, he's now heading west. The nimblest one climbed, stumbled through thin air. He's not yet fallen yet, but he's halfway there. The one that remains can't make up her mind. Twenty-five steps ahead, or five steps behind. Okay. Ah, this is the clock puzzle. We don't even have the pieces for the thing yet. 
Okay, what am I looking at? Weird. Man, look at this place. Alright, and I'm actually going to call it here, guys. Um, I've just been uh, sitting in on two sessions in a row, and I'm actually pretty tired, especially those puzzles. Um, well, the, the second part of that coin puzzle, specifically, really took a lot out of me. Um, why is it stuck on tutorial? It's weird. Um, I am... Uh, other than that puzzle... Um, like the rest of the puzzles uh, seem fine, like the, the coin one. It's just the second out of the four that we had that was that didn't make sense to me, anyway. Maybe it made sense to you, but I don't know. It, it's it, it was very misleading. Well, let, let's at least put it that way. Um, uh, but I, I'm not uh, regretting the difficulty of the puzzles that I put. Uh, again, I put it on hard. Uh, I'm not regretting it all. Um, it's uh, quite a bit of a good challenge. Um, if anything, I even with the safe one, when I was stock, locked in the room and had to find the combination of the safe, it wasn't that hard. I, I just thought there was going to be four numbers instead of the three. That was my own mistake. But again, that's you learn, right? But uh, I'm enjoying the game so far. Uh, we just entered the other world. This is when shit kind of start to get go crazy. Um, and we haven't even hit, like, the first uh, main point of, like, the act. We're not even near the end of Act 1 yet. Uh, we're, we're getting to that point. But uh, we're, we're not quite there yet. And I'm actually intrigued as to how long the game is. Because, like, if I've been playing the original, even as a first time, I would be, like so far ahead by now i'd be like at the hospital by now um we've been playing for what like three four hours yeah i'd definitely be at the hospital at this point we barely even made it out of the the woodside apartments which is like the first major location of the game so interesting how they've uh you know double or even kind of tripled the the playtime from the original and now you can kind of see why uh, I guess it's just a lot more of the the locations that they've kind of expanded on. You know what I mean? There's a lot more sightseeing going on, a lot more exploration you can actually do. Um, and it's a lot slower. The game is surprisingly a lot slower paced, I'm finding. Um, which is not a bad thing. Not a bad thing at all. Don't get me wrong. If anything, I feel like the combat is kind of hindered because of it. But it kind of makes sense. And again, I'll get into it um, during my final thoughts in the game. Uh, but again, I'm enjoying the game so far. It's it's pretty good. It's I'm trying to have like zero expectations uh, of the game, and so far, no real complaints. So I hope you guys feel the same way too. Hope you guys are enjoying the playthrough. Um, I'll be excited for the next one. I'm, I'm excited to keep exploring uh, the other side uh, apartment world. Thank you all so much for watching, guys, and I'll see you in the next one. Take care.